Hello, welcome to my channel. In this video, I would like to show how to do aggregations with Node.js client for Elasticsearch. Aggregations is a bit uh, different concept in Elasticsearch and than searches. Uh, aggregations are used for get some data for analytics, such as um, different for example, the sum of some fields or the max or mean for some fields. And there is a separate section on Elasticsearch documentation for aggregations. And it's done using this object for aggregations which is passed additional to the search object on APIs. And there are sections for all different aggregations. In this example, I will be doing uh, some aggregation. So this first part is query for the search and the second part is aggregation part to get in the sum. So I have here the project I created in my one of my previous videos. I leave the link in the description box and this is just a simple API solution for different API endpoints. So, and here I will create, and this was about creating workouts. And I just have there opened Kibana and I have here a workout index with two documents. So for cardio and weights and for cardio duration is 50 and for weight 33. And what I will be doing, create an endpoint to get a total duration. So for that I will just create new endpoint. to total duration so and here I will do the search on the client client is the client from Elasticsearch client. So on the client, I do search and construct search here. The first will need specify index. In my case, it's workout. And next, we specify body. And body is um, the aggregation object from this uh, Elasticsearch documentation for, in my case, I'm using this one, but for others, it, it can be this one or for Max, say, it will be this. And this is the part, like in the example for the sum, the first part is query. You can include this or not include, it depends. 
on the your goal because aggregation will be performed based on their query so I'm um, don't include any query just index workout and uh, I can just copy this part and modify Uh, what I'm doing here, workout duration instead. And I'm doing some on the field duration. So after that. Specify function for response or error spawn response status. So say if error then just cancel look something action not something just error <laughs> and else to the API response stop I think something is I figure out so Status will be two hundred. Then we will send a response from our Elasticsearch aggregation result. So message will put response get just aggregations from there and we can uh, lock in the console whole response Search, search, and closing API endpoint. So save that. Start. My application. And go to Postman. So let's check. What we had there, so we expect eighty three. So we create and 
here our message workout duration volume 83 so and as I said for the body here you can include any aggregation you want to perform and then that concludes my short demo thanks for watching and leave me comments or requests this is basically my video based on the request i get from the one of the videos in the comments so thanks for watching see you in my next video bye